Damn it, I'm in Mexico. Good morning, and welcome to the Black Mesa I would like to uh, make it known that I haven't actually this played Half-Life. provided for the security and convenience of the Black Mesa Research Facility personnel. I've 100 percented Half-Life 2. The time is 8.47 a.m. As well as the... Current topside temperature is 93 degrees. With an estimated high of 105. The Black Mesa compound is maintained at a pleasant 68 degrees at all times. Yeah, as well as the episodes. So they finally shut up now, thankfully. Um, but yeah. The game was so old that my computer couldn't actually run it. It was just stuck in the infinite loading, well, black screen, really. So yeah, this will be my first experience. This train is inbound from level 3 dormitories to sector C test labs and control facilities. If your intended destination is a high security area beyond Sector C, you will need to return to the Central Transit Hub in Area 9 and board a high security train. Right. If you have not yet submitted your identity <laughs> to the retinal clearance system, you must report to Black Mesa personnel for processing before you will be permitted into the high security branch of the transit system. I'm gonna kill that voice. No smoking, eating, or drinking are permitted within the Black Mesa Transit System. That reminds me, I need to drink some water. I've got a new bottle, it's a bit louder. Yeah. But, you know, on the plus side, it isn't slowly poisoning me. So, you know, you win some, you lose some. The employer. Yeah. As I was saying before I got rudely interrupted, you know, we really don't know how he got this job. He just appeared and everyone just kind of went with it. I've never seen him do any kind of physics. I mean, he might as well just be a security guard. I mean, he doesn't even speak. He doesn't know how to speak. That's a usually... Reminder to all Black Mesa personnel. Regular radiation and biohazard screenings are a requirement of continued employment in the Black Mesa Research Facility. Missing a scheduled urinalysis or radiation checkup is grounds for immediate termination. Yeah, usually communication is pretty important for- SHUT UP! It's pretty important for, uh, you know, science and all that. Please stand back from the automated door and wait for the security officer to verify your identity. Before exiting the train, be sure to check your area for personal belongings. Aw oh, man, you cut the ponytail. Gordon had a ponytail? <laughs> Not gonna lie, I would have loved to see that. Hey, Mr. Freeman. I had a bunch of messages for you, but we had a system crash about, I don't know, 20 minutes ago, and I'm still trying to find my files. Just one of those days, I guess. They were also having some problems down in the test chamber, too, but I think that's all straightened out. They told me to make sure you headed down there as soon as you got into your hazard suit. Just shoot it with a gun. That's how I solve most of my problems. Gordon? But... But I'm Gordon. Hey, I know that guy. Yep. Hello. Hey, don't mind me. Good heavens! What the hell? I got an achievement for that. Can I do it again? You think you can fix the vending machine too, college boy? No toilet paper. 
Uh, don't worry, I'll go get covered, man. Oh, thank heavens. I'm in dire need of some toilet paper. <laughs> Got an achievement for that as well. And Welcome to the HEC Mark 4. There's an AI in my head. I'm starting to understand why Gordon doesn't speak. Every time he try, he just gets interrupted. That's definitely not a safety issue. Is this OSHA compliant? He doesn't want anyone to know. Ah! Now where did I leave that shutdown procedure chart? I'm sure it's a short Ooh, Okay. <laughs> Hello, Dr. Beaman. Goodbye. It changes. They're a bit strange. Oh! It's about to go critical. My bad. I earned this job. Bye. The entire game is actually just you going in the lab, shoving the crystal in the thing, and just nothing of particular interest really happens, and then you just go home. That's it. Testament will be delivered to you in a few moments. Now, if you would be so good as to climb up and start Ooh. the rotors. That way we can bring the anti-mask spectrometer to 80%. Get away from the <laughs> I got an achievement for that. Get me out! I might have a wife and kids, I don't know. They're fine. Yeah, I'm... And I'm dead again. Woohoo! Never mind. Oh. What? We're gonna. Three, four, We're gonna have to put him down. I'm sorry. Damn it! Breathe. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Does he have a gun? Someone know that we're stranded down here. There's no telling what kind of danger is. <laughs> I knew I shouldn't have fiddled those. You better not get any ideas and keep one of those as a pet. I'm very happy I didn't walk. Eh. Ah! Ow! Um, someone open the door, please. As a theoretical physicist, I gotta say, I don't think this is uh, possible. Oh, you can just jump through it, okay. Take a wrench, you can fix it. I don't think they're fixing that. Oh no, they're not climbable. Never mind, they are. Okay. Ow! Shoot, please. Thank you. Honestly, I think more first person shooters should be like this. You asked for it! Where you don't actually shoot the gun, you just have someone else who shoots the enemies for you while you walk around helplessly. I 
don't think it's snowing. Ah! I am, though. Ow! Jeez, they do a lot of damage. Okay. Yummy. For excitement today. Um, you're welcome to stay if you want. Damn, honestly, I'm impressed, mate. How much blood is in this guy? Will we ever make it out of here? Too bad he didn't get to be a donor. Oh, uh, there's bloody head crabs. Sucker. You good? You, uh... You right, man? Yeah, there we go. No, oh, there's two of them. Make that free. Oh, you know what? I probably have to go across these um, oddly placed pipes. Yeah, that could do it. Oh, look. Right, well, I was gonna, like, do a David Attenborough thing, but I don't think I want to anymore. Why didn't I see this coming? You know, I was about to hit that with a crowbar. There, yeah. Ooh, look, explosive. Who could have seen that coming? Idiot. How do they move around? Like, how do they get to places? Because they don't move. They're just kind of there. <laughs> Is there another alien that just moves them around? Or do they sprout legs and have a little walk? Hey, good news. Help just arrived. Wait, wait! What the hell? Get off of me! You're welcome. Thanks. I owe you one. Ah, uh, here, let me get this open. Wait. You know we're not allowed to eat or drink, right? So if you don't save them, can you just completely miss the shotgun? I, uh, I heard screams up ahead. Uh, you don't say. First. I've been going first a lot. I think it's someone else. All right. Right behind you, buddy. Ow. Sorry, Doc. Fantastic. It feels weird shooting them. I used to. I'm used to me being buddies, you know? But I can't Stay get back. Things. Take her! It's not my time! Oh, what you son of a bitch! Hey! What are you doing? Teaching them a lesson. You better be loaded, sir. Ah, crap! Up there! Oh. Uh. 
you know, the, the, yeah, the game's a bit different to Stardew. I will continue Stardew eventually. <laughs> um, I'm just finding something else to do while I wait. There's actually a new update. Um, they realized that people didn't like Lewis, so they gave you a gun. Can we, uh, pay Clint a visit later? Oh yeah, also there's aliens. Because why not? Great. I love dying in one hit. Gordon. Have you heard of a thing called a diet? Hey, hey, crabs and vents. Okay. Maybe, maybe they're not as bad as I thought. I, I can't hold on much longer. Help! I don't think there's much I can do. I'm gonna say props to him. Oh no. Do I have to use him as a platform? Okay, no. I don't think he's super rigid anymore. Unfortunately. But you know, he had a good thing going. Until he died. But then most people do, to be honest.